Okay guys, I am gonna show you guys how I do my no makeup makeup look. I've been wanting to have a no makeup look for a long time, but I just like couldn't find the right products and I feel like I finally found it and it's effortless, but still, you know, cute and I feel done up and it's great. So, I'm gonna show you guys. All right, first, let's curl our eyelashes. Next, we're gonna use Laura Mercier's uh, Illuminating Canvas Primer. It is so glowy, like, even if I put uh, my regular foundation on, um, it still looks glowy from underneath my foundation, which is like weird and crazy to me, but like it really makes my face like glowy and I love it. And it makes the foundation go on very smooth, so. This is a new product that I recently got and I really, really, really like it. Okay, first, let's do our brows. I actually got my brows flipped, um, did a brow flip and tint. So I don't really need much, uh, but just to kind of like bring it up a little bit. So I am using the SOS Tower 28 uh, Face Mist, and I'm just gonna put it on his Patrick's Wax. Uh, I have the clear. I actually am pretty curious to try the tinted one, um, but for me, like, I have other brow stuff, so I thought clear was good if I needed, like, just a regular clear wax. So, I'm gonna just brush it on and bring it up. Another brow product that I like, um, if you need a little bit of help in filling it in, is the Glossier Brow Flick. It really is amazing, and it's like a little pen, and then you just kind of like flick and add some extra like brows. Next is blush. Love this blush. This is Patrick Patrick Ta's So Cheap So LA, and it is a blush and a cream. And this is my first time using a blush, cream blush, and it's amazing. Like I don't think I'll ever go back to just like a regular uh, blush. So I was told that usually you use the cream blush first and then the powdered blush, but on Patrick's video that I saw that he posted talking about this, this product, he said actually the powder first and then the cream. Um, so, which I kind of agree with when I'm like putting it on. It makes sense that the cream kind of goes on top and makes it just dewy at the end. It just kind of warms it up. Now let's do a little bit of uh, concealer. I would have definitely done this first, but I just want to do a little bit because like literally just a little bit because I don't want um it to look like i have makeup on and like white i don't want that i want it to kind of look warm match my skin tone so i'm just tiny tiny bit this is before i get my cheek fillers <laughs> i'm getting them done this week just to kind of help with the sunken in look Keeping it mild though. Perfect. Now, lashes. Always, always gotta do the lashes. Okay, so 
I'm gonna use a lash primer. I have the actual full size set, but or the full size bottle, but I don't know where it went. This is the Lancome uh, Booster XL primer, and it really works and it's great. Just the end a little bit. I don't want it to be too like bold. Then I like the telescopic carbon black um, mascara when I'm trying to do like a not so bold look. Um, just like little but kind of long lashes. Kind of just natural lashes. I'm going to use the lash curler one more time and then probably shouldn't do that but I like them. Perfect. And then last but not least, add a little bit of highlighter and then actually no, this isn't last but not least. Highlighter and then lips and then we're done. And then a little bit of gloss. And that's it. I added a little bit more mascara after I looked at myself, but that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, quick and easy. It, I feel like I took a little bit of time, but usually takes me like three to four minutes and it's so easy. Um, and it's cute and summery and yeah, it takes no time. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.